Hey guys, as you can see, Debbie and I are very excited about healthier Easter baskets. We're having a lot of fun discussing ideas and sharing them with you. And um, I've been collecting things as well. So hopefully you watched her video about some ideas that she grabbed from Target. And I'm gonna share some ideas of things I found as well. And uh, I wasn't even thinking of shopping at Target for Easter basket stuff, but when Debbie said that she found some interesting options, um, I ran in real quick grabbed a few things. One thing I found was organic bunny gummies. I'm in this cute little box. My kids, I don't know, they're really into packaging, so um, they will enjoy the box as well as the gummies. Um, so that was a good find. Um, I also found these at Whole Foods. Uh, I had been eyeing them online, but um, hadn't picked them up, and so I grabbed these from Whole Foods, and I did a good job. I only taste tested one of them, but it was really, really good. Um, and I had one of my kids taste test it also, and he gave it a major thumbs up. So these are good. They also have other varieties, some with peanut butter, toasted coconut, and dark chocolate are the options. Um, so you might want to check those out. I saw those at Whole Foods. They're on Amazon too. Um, this is at Trader Joe's. If you shop there, just jelly beans without all of the artificial colors. These... Um, come from spirulina extract, beta carotene. Um, I don't love that there's, this does have natural flavors on the list. And so I don't love that because I don't know what that is. And I wish they would just say, but you know, we're going for junk food here. So um, it does have carrot concentrate, pumpkin, apple, radish, that kind of thing. So that could be an interesting option. Um, also these unreal peanut butter, they're like a, um, Reese's peanut butter cup replacement. Um, these are pretty good. Um, I think I found this at Whole Foods as well. Um, and then some cute non-food things. I found these little things at Target. This was a dollar for two little Lego guys. There's like four different options. If you have a little boy who likes Legos, totally grab these from Target. Such a good deal um, to get two Lego guys for a dollar. So he's going to go crazy for that. Um, I also found these color twist crayons. So that's another like fun non-food thing that I'm going to put in um, the two younger ones basket that they'll really enjoy. Um, okay. And I found some other like stickers and coloring books and just a few little things that are just not all about food because I don't want them to be loaded up even on the healthier junk. It's still, it's still junk, right? It's still a treat. Um, I did get these from Amazon, Zolly Pops Clean Teeth Pops sugar-free, gluten-free, non-GMO, vegan, blah, blah, blah. Um, so we have not taste tested these quite yet. I'll let you know. It has stevia, turmeric, um, beetroot juice, stuff like that in it. So much less junky than a traditional lollipop. And we're going to be doing some natural egg dyes. So when we do this, I'll give you a review and let you know if it was easy to work with. Um, sure, it'll be fine. So we'll have some fun with some natural dyes for eggs. So um, as we get a little closer to Easter and you guys have your own ideas, we'd love to hear them and uh, share kind of what um, you guys are finding that tastes good, things that the kids liked. And if you have um, Easter things that are for grownups, share those too, because sometimes grownups get to have Easter treats as well. So let us know if this kind of stuff is helpful. Um, we can continue to do some additional sort of non-oil um, health education sharing if this is something that you guys are looking for.